I'm blinded by the light. I know, it's a little bright today in New York, but thank God it was wow. snowing this morning, first day of spring. Is this April? No, it's March. <laughs> I don't even know what year it is. Are you kidding? Well, where am I? What galaxy? No, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Renovate your apartment. See how you feel. I okay, like the email this week that she sent me. She's like, oh, Carlin, when you're done digesting your sushi, maybe you can send a disclosure form to ASEC so that we can go to our conference. I thought that was really smart and Meanwhile, mean. while I'm running the vacuum again... Oh, well, you're having sushi at a fancy <laughs> restaurant. Would you mind? Would yes, you mind? Yes. So now, you, now you, this is, you, you see our interaction, and the title of this is? The Ideal Sex Partner. So if friends can't be ideal, you can imagine what happens with the sex, sex partners. Partner. I'm not interested in sex. I've never had an orgasm except <laughs> masturbating, watching lesbian porn. <laughs> you're gay. Anyway. Uh, how oh. <laughs> You know, we don't know. Bye. Uh, yeah. How can I start enjoying real sex with my real boyfriend and stop watching only lesbian porn? Well, we got a problem right away with the term real boyfriend and real sex. What is real sex? Yeah, what is real? I mean, I think if you're having an orgasm, it's pretty real. And I know everybody says, you make too much to do about orgasm, but uh, it's satisfying an appetite. I had such a good orgasm the other day that I fell asleep. And my wand on my chest. <laughs> oh, holding your beloved close to your heart. <laughs> so do you think she should stop masturbating and watching lesbian porn? No, we think that that's the best thing for her. That's her outlet. That's what you need to it do. Works. It yeah. works. So yeah. why would you have yeah. any problem with something that works? Because she feels that she should love her real boyfriend and have real sex, which is penetration and heterosexual and blah, oh. blah, blah. But let's say she's if not gay, definitely bi. She's definitely bi. You're definitely bisexual. Enjoy yourself. Go get it. Have a girlfriend. Tell your boyfriend that you want a girlfriend. And you might want to have sex with your boyfriend more when you have the girlfriend. Yes, yes. That's the whole thing. Once we create sexual energy, yep. we can bring that into our relationship. We can bring that home. So sometimes, you know, whether it's flirting or having a relationship with someone else, having sex, whatever. Sex begets more sex. When you're, when you're having sex, the energy is going. I had a friend who said she knew that her boyfriend was cheating on her because he started to have sex with her more often. <laughs> I have a new boyfriend and find myself masturbating more often than usual. I told him that I masturbate. I told him that I masturbate and he thinks that I shouldn't need to since I'm having sex with him. Is this normal? Yeah. And this comes from one of my favorite members, Nina, from the UK. Oh, um, really? Well, if, the, if this is a fairly recent boyfriend... <laughs> She might consider recycling right away yeah. before it gets before she gets in deeper. I would have turned it around and asked him, like, are you still masturbating? Well, even no. if he were or were not, what is this? You can only have sex with me. You can't have sex with yourself now that I'm in the picture. That's not healthy. It's not. She's, I don't think so. She's got a problem right away. And, and it'll, it'll compound. And I think you masturbate more when you're into someone because then Absolutely. you're having the good sex, you're thinking about the sex, planning for the sex, remembering the, the sex. sex you just had. <laughs> so mm. you're going to be like hotter yep. and you're going to have to release yep. that energy somehow. I'm 64 in a long term marriage and would like to get my wife to enjoy foreplay in her course and sharing masturbation. She's never liked foreplay and wants to be penetrated and have it over quickly. How can I get her to be more interested in sex? Oh well, doesn't sound like she ever was. No, she. So it, so what it is is that um, she never wasn't that much into foreplay. He went through his own. The, it's a, the, the question goes on much longer. He went into his own decline, and he got on antidepressants. And that will kill your erection. People, your antidepressants drive. will take away mm -hmm. your sex interest slash drive, whatever. If the erections go away, and women come to me and they say, I can't have an orgasm. Then the first thing I say is, well, tell me what meds you're on. Leave your wife alone. You know, if she, this, the, the, one of our shows are going to be soon, The Joy of No Partner Sex. As an older woman, I can speak to this. The joy, I know if you're young, there's no way you're going to end. No, there's too many interesting people, and you just have that, that biological drive is so strong. So everybody knows is that I have recreated this affair with myself, that I'm getting back in touch with my own sexuality since Eric and I are not having partner sex. And um, I've been in a bad mood. You have been. Yes. You have to be nicer to you. Hello. And then she'll be nicer to I'm me. I'm having trouble dealing with myself. I'm having trouble liking myself. 
I'm having trouble getting interested in having sex with myself. This is a confession of a long time, lifetime masturbator, professional masturbator. <laughs> well, I know that, that I say it's true love is yourself. I'm having trouble loving myself, but I'm, I'm really going to make a bigger effort, and next week I hope to have a good report, other than watching the dirtiest porn I can find. 